Hey guys, in today's video, I have another roleplay. I know it's been a while since I've done ones. In today's video, Aria and I are going to be visiting some of the new things that were added in the Bloxburg Halloween update. And as you can see, um, we already started decorating. <laughs> I honestly could not wait for a video to decorate, so that is why everything is already decorated. But let me know down below in the comments if you guys want to see me decorating because I do have another house on another plot and I don't mind decorating that one for a video as well. So today I'm going to start off by making some a very, very late breakfast. As you can see, we are running on different times here in Bloxburg. <laughs> and today I think I'm going to make some pancakes because Aria's favorite breakfast is pancakes if I can find it. So it is right here and as you can see we kind of started decorating the kitchen a little bit for Halloween and I'm so excited for Halloween this month I don't know why I've never been a fan of Halloween I've always loved Christmas growing up but for some reason this year it actually gives me something to look forward to and it's just really exciting Oh, and also don't mind all my Coeptus photos back there. I plan on putting some, I plan on making some family GFX and putting them in there, but I just haven't done so yet. So um, don't mind. Oh my gosh, I already missed a step. <gasps> okay, so breakfast is ready. I think we'll just have breakfast right here. And let's see, I'm going to get some drinks for us. So I'm going to drink, I think I'll just drink water for this morning and then I'll give Aria some orange juice. Okay, let me set this up for us. Ari's gonna sit right here and I'll sit right here. My flowers disappeared. I had some friends over the other day and they stole my flowers. How dare they? Also guys, this is kind of what it looks like a floor. But now it is time to wake up Aria because I am starving as you can see. Hello my little Aria. Good morning little princess. It's time to wake up. Oh look at her. She has her little sleepy face on. <laughs> Time to get ready. All right, so I already have my little outfit on, so I'm going to wait for Aria downstairs in the kitchen as she gets ready. And also I put some candy out here for trick or treating later on this month. We have some Halloween pails right here. I think it's super cute. I'm gonna pick one up. Look how cute that is. Woohoo! I'm going trick or treating. Can I take my own trick or treating or candy? Oh my gosh, look, yes, look, I took my own candy. Woohoo! I wonder if it, you get more every single time like does it fill up that'd be so cool if it like filled up all the way to the top but yeah we have some spider webs everywhere and stuff like that all right so i'm going to go sit right here and wait for aria to be ready hello sweetie good morning oh you look so cute remind me during the month to go take you um halloween shopping because we need to get you some halloween outfits breakfast is ready breakfast is ready sweetie i know it's your fave yes yeah, she loves pancakes <laughs> Dig in, sweetie. I'm really excited for today because I know that Bloxburg added a apple stand and they also are selling pumpkin spice lattes. So I'm going to bring Aria there so we can get some. Um, make sure to drink your drink too, sweetie. No candy. <laughs> I see you eyeing that bowl. <laughs> I see you eyeing the bowl of candy. Oh, I'm glad you love it. Okay, so it's time to go. I'm all ready. Are you all ready, sweetie? Yes, you're all ready. Let's go. Also, guys, we ended up decorating the front too. Let me make sure that this door is locked. Okay, it is locked. But yeah, this is our neighborhood. And we are going to get into this car. Oop. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we are going... Oh my gosh. So we kind of had a late breakfast. As you can see, we woke up kind of late. We just got home from visiting some of our family in a different state so our time's a little different so that is why it is nighttime right now <laughs> but yeah um i think the apple stand is going to be right over here around this corner oh my gosh i see two people and it's late and dark we'll talk to them after okay let's get some oh look at they have some pumpkins that is really expensive for a small pumpkin and they also have some apples you can buy for two dollars seventy dollars for a huge pumpkin hmm Ooh, do you want something from here sweetie let's see i think they have okay so they have a caramel apple they also have a pumpkin spice latte and apple cider oh of course sweetie let me get this for you and i'm going to give that to you okay and then i'm going to have a pumpkin spice latte oh my gosh this looks so good <laughs> aria loves like sweet treats she has a sweet tooth for like the sweetest things ever oh look how cute <laughs> 
Oh my gosh, this is so cute over here. Should we go over? You know what? Let's go over to them. Let's go over to them. Oh, two teenagers. Hi, guys. How are you? Oh, don't get scared, Ari. <laughs> it's okay. We'll get them a drink um, after. Oh, he has like little flies on him as if he hasn't taken a shower in days. Oh, well, this is our home? Your home is a gas station? Oh my gosh, this is like in the middle of nowhere. Oh, do you guys have parents? Where are your parents? You don't have a house? What do you mean you don't have a house? They left us? <gasps> yes, sweetie? Can we invite them for dinner? <gasps> of course we can. Of course, that'd be so nice of us. Okay, slaps flies. Oh, it looks like they haven't taken a shower in days. I don't want to leave you guys out here alone like this. Would you really invite us? Yes, of course. You both are teenagers and you're young. I don't trust people out here. People just look mean. Well, there's only one lady over there, but <laughs> we would love to come. <laughs> These kids really do need a home. Ew, this is disgusting. What do you mean they're disgusting? <gasps> oh my gosh, that was so mean. It's that lady again. What do you mean? That lady again? She spilled her drink on me. Oh, that was so rude. Oh, don't be scared, Aria. Don't be scared, sweetie. Yes, yeah, she throws food on us every day. I just got this shirt with all the money I saved up. Oh, she totally ruined your shirt. I just got these jeans. Oh, those look like new jeans too. Oh, I'm really sorry that this happens to you. Oh my gosh, she's back. Why are you people still here? Well, these kids look homeless. They are disgusting. How are they disgusting? They don't have a home and they aren't able to take a shower. We are homeless. Aww. Lady, you are ruining their clothes. Their new clothes that they bought. They have no other clothes. Come over for dinner. You are invited. Oh, my drink got cold. Stay back, lady. Oh my gosh, this lady. Arya, stay back. I don't trust this lady. All right, kids, get in the car. We're gonna go to our house and have some dinner because I, I honestly cannot leave these kids out here like that because that lady is crazy. Who knows what else she's done to them. So I'm gonna go bring these kids back home and feed them a really nice dinner. I think I will make them some turkey or something. They're probably really hungry. They probably have not had a full-on meal in probably forever because... They don't have any parents, they don't have a home, and they need a shower. Look at this. I don't want to leave these kids out here like that. Yes, this is my house. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we're here, kids. This is our house. We just finished decorating it. Oh my gosh, if I can park, that'd be great. <laughs> my parking job's not that good, but we're going to work on it, okay? Yeah. Um, it's, it's pretty big. Uh, we have a lot of space here. Let me close this so that we don't have any like weird people coming in or that crazy lady again. Come in, come in. It'll be okay. Oh, thank you. Yes, it is very festive. We love Halloween. Maybe one day we can visit your house for dinner. Oh, yeah. Aria, I don't think they have any parents or family. We don't have one. We don't have a house. Well, you are more than welcome to come here if you would like. No, sweetie, they not everybody has a house or parents. Since they don't have family, sweetie, we might just we might just have to adopt them. You are more than welcome to come in and use our bathroom. Oh, it's so sad. Yes, it's so sad. Come on, come on, guys. It'll be okay. You guys are more than welcome to come into our house. Come. Come on, sweetie. I think my little Aria needs a bath too soon. Come on, guys. <laughs> wow, thank you. Of course. Yes, yes. Come in. Make yourselves feel at home. A piano? Yes, a piano. Do you play piano? I think one of them plays piano. I do. Oh, play, play, play. Whoa, this is so cool. Oh, thank you so much. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> Look at little Aria. She's still holding her little apple. <laughs> Where's the bathroom? The bathroom is right here, honey. We have this one right here, and then we also have the kids' bathroom upstairs. Can you show us the bathrooms are? Yes, so one is right here. If you need to take a quick bath, um, go ahead. There's towels in there as well. And then for you, Ashton, we have one upstairs. Okay, I'm gonna go get started on, where did Ari go? We have some unicorn on. I'm going to go make some dinner, sweetie. I'm going to make them, let's do some turkey. Oh my gosh, every time I like try to open my fridge, that always happens. Like I open my cabinets and stuff. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to bake some turkey because they probably haven't had a delicious meal in so long. And I want to be able to feed them and make sure that they've eaten a good meal at least. 
honestly, I don't really know what's going to happen after dinner. I I feel bad if I let them go back out there in the world because they they're just kids, you know? And I as a mother figure myself, I I can't do that. Hello, miss. Oh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Also, don't mind this baby seat right here. I've been babysitting my niece, so that is why I um, have this right here. Thanks for inviting us for dinner. Of course, of course, of course. Make yourself feel at home. Don't be afraid or shy. Where are the girls? The girls are watching TV. <laughs> I think they are. Okay. okay, I'm going to finish making dinner. I just heard the bell ring for our turkey, so I'm going to take that out and start garnishing that. Ooh, cute. So fast, so many steps. There's so many steps in making turkey. There's a lot that goes to it. So we're gonna stuff the turkey with some of these bell peppers. I think that's bell peppers. Okay, so I'm gonna go set the table over here. And I'm also going to make some, what should we make? Should we make like a beef stew? Let's do some chili. I wanna make sure that we have enough food so that we can feed everybody here. And I can hear the kids chatting. It looks like they are talking about names. They're just getting to know each other, it looks like. So that's pretty good. So Ashton and Ashley, I think they're twins because, I mean, their names are kind of similar. They kind of, they look like twins too. They look like they are related. So I'm going to ask if they are twins. Wait, I just heard them say they're twins. Yes, they're twins. I knew it. I knew it that they were twins. Okay, there we go. We have this. And then the last thing I need to do is get our drinks ready. So I'm going to go put this over here. And then let me grab some drinks. I think I'm just going to grab everybody some water from my pantry. So we have some water right here. There's like four of us. Yeah, there's four of us. Let me get four waters. Okay, so the table is all set. I think we have enough food. Turkey's there and everything. The kids are just watching TV. Okay, dinner is ready, everyone. We don't have a TV. Aw, oh, they don't have a TV. Come on, guys, dinner's ready. We don't watch TV. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Time to eat dinner. No more unicorn. <laughs> Yay food. Feel free to sit, come sit. Where do we sit? Anywhere you'd like. Here, have some turkey. I give that to Ashley. I give that portion to Ashton and then Aria. This looks so good. Oh, thank you so much. I'm not the best cook, but I try to be. I, I follow the recipes and stuff. And then also we have some chili if you guys like to as well. I must ask, how long have you been homeless? About eight months, I think. I lost track of time. Months? That's a long time. That is way too long to be living out in the streets like that. Especially like during winter. You guys must have been cold. Yes, Aria, we can speak in the kitchen. It's hard to sleep much. It gets cold, then it's winter again. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Aria and I will be right back. We'll be in the kitchen getting some more food. Can we invite them round for the night? Yes, yes, yes. That would be smart. I, I don't want to kick them out. Yes, yes. We can have them stay the night. I... I don't want to leave them out there in the cold. They seem really friendly. Oh, I'm really glad that you've been getting along with him. I know it's kind of lonely as like an only child, but you know, it'll be it'll get better. We'll see. Oh, I want a friend. Oh, okay, okay. I can we can we can we, mommy? Oh, yes. Okay, let's go back to eating dinner. As you can see, Ari is really excited. <laughs> hey, hey guys. We were um checking some food on the stove. Making sure it doesn't burn, you know. Okay, so since you don't have a home and we don't want you going back to the streets, how would you two feel about joining our family? You two are sweet. And Aria would love to have siblings as well. I know it's been kind of lonely. Yes, really. <laughs> yes, really. You would do that? Yes, of course. I I don't I don't want to leave um, you two out there in the cold like that. Yes, we would. Oh, okay, awesome. So tomorrow we will go to the adoption center, but you two need some sleep. Come with me. Okay, so if we go upstairs, since we don't have a room downstairs available, um, so Aria, the girls can stay in here. Ashley, you can stay in here with Aria. We have a bunk bed because Aria has a lot of cousins and she loves having sleepovers, so we have a bunk bed for here, but um, it'll be perfect for you two. And then for you, Ashton, we actually used to house foreign exchange students. So we have an extra room. Follow me. It'll be right over here. So this is an extra room right here. And this is where you'll be staying. 
very roomy there's a tv right here we also have a computer i think yeah the girls have a computer room as well oh. <laughs> ashton look a tv yes guys you have a tv the girls room doesn't have a tv just yet i might have to add one later on maybe on the wall or something but they do have a um computer as well i assume that they have not grown up watching tv this place is awesome oh thank you so much all right guys get some rest um feel free to take a shower if you need to the kids um restroom is right out there um we have a big day tomorrow so um everybody it's bedtime come on aria bedtime <laughs> get ready for bed everybody <laughs> Good night, mommy. Good night, kiddos. Good night, Aria. Okay, so I'm going to let the girls do their thing. I think I need a shower. Let me say good night to Ashton. Lies in bed. Good night, Ashton. Good night, miss. Okay, turn this light off for you. And it looks like I need a shower because I've been out all day, as you can see. And I think I just want to relax. We have a big day tomorrow, so I'm going to take a little bubble bath and get ready for bed. I don't know why I'm still wearing my purse. <laughs> I must keep my purse on the at all times. Totally didn't mean to fix that. <laughs> it's been a long day and I think it's time for us to go to bed. All right, so I am here at the adoption center and it looks pretty nice. Hello, Miss Frizzles. It's nice to see you again. Hello, welcome to Adopt a Donut. Oh my gosh, that is such a cute name. Please have a seat and we will call you when we are ready. Okay, okay, I will sit right here. And let me grab a book so it looks like I am reading a magazine. Look how cute that is, it's so funny. <laughs> Please wait in the lobby until assisted. And then we have National Adoption Day, celebrating a family for every child. How adorable is that? <laughs> Okay, so it looks like they are ready. Where should I go? Okay, so it says to follow her into their office. So I guess it's just down this hallway over here. How can I help you today? Okay, so my kids aren't actually here right now. They are at home. So the kids that I want to adopt, they are at home watching my youngest daughter, Aria. So they can't be here today, but I am here to sign adoption papers to adopt Ashton and Ashley. They are twins. They might actually be in your system files let me check for them okay i feel that i'm ready to love and take care of my child yes i am ready to adopt twins okay yes first i have ashton's file the twins ran away from their parents because they weren't having a good life oh that is so sad i i found them on the streets the other day i could not help but ask them if they would like to come over for dinner and stay the night because i just i didn't want to leave them out there like that in the cold so i would like to adopt both ashton and ashley okay yes here are the adoption papers if i could have you sign this line right here okay let me sign that all right there we go okay thank you i will put this in our files you are now the guardian of ashton and ashley congratulations oh my gosh thank you so much miss frizzle thank you for allowing me to give these children a home a warm and loving home and family um i honestly am so excited oh my gosh all right so that is going to be it for this role play also i'm really excited that we are gonna have a bigger family and aria is super excited as well i know she's been wanting siblings and i know that it's been kind of lonely for her so this will be great for her as well as the twins we'll finally have a nice and warming home thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned for more role plays because I have a lot planned for this month. And I will see you guys in my next video. I haven't done this in so long. <laughs> Bye, guys.